my name is Rami and I'm going to teach you how to solve the Rubik's Cube. As you see, it's already solved. I messed it up and now I'm going to teach you how to do the flower, which is the first step. So this is how it's going to look like. It's going to look like this. It's got white edges around it and a yellow dot in the middle. So how to do it is when it's like this, all around, you have to look what's the, where the yellow is and let's find an edge. Oh, there's one. Let's match it up. So we turn it around and then we put it up. And now we have two here, two white edges here. And now let's, we found another one. Let's put it up there. And now we have another one. And here's another one. Let's just go ahead and, and if it's like this on the bottom, you put it up, it, it's right here now. But if we put it up, it's gonna take away this one. So let's put it back and then you turn the center, it'll go up here and then you can put it up there. And that is how to do the flower. Next, you see the white edge, how it's white and red. Let's go ahead and match it up with the red. Like that. And then we turn it around to match up with the white. And now let's go ahead back to this. And then do the same thing as we did for the other one. And go back and then we put it on the green. And we put it back doesn't matter if there's one here so now we've got one left here let's go ahead and match it up just like that and then match it up with the white now we have a white cross so now as you see we need to match up the corners let's go ahead and find a corner there there's a corner with white it has green and orange so we all know that it has to go in the green and orange, right up here. So the way to do that, it's to match it up, like with the green, there's the white, and the orange is on the bottom, but we need it to be here, but up there. So this is how we do it, we turn, we turn it like that, we turn this, and then here, we just have to turn it around, it'll be matched up, and then we put it back up, it's there. And now, there's an orange and green, and it's done. Now let's go ahead and find another one, there, blue, let's match it up. And now, let's do the same thing. It's all lined up, and done. So now we have a full orange, and a full green. Oh, there's one there. There. We found a red one and a blue one. That's a red matched up. Blue is on the bottom. So let's turn this. And now let's put it together. And then put it back up. So we don't mess it up. And now we do the same thing to this one. Turn it together. And we've solved the top. Now we need to solve the second layer. So you just find one without a yellow piece on it from the bottom. So there is a blue and orange, blue and orange. So you match it up with the blue, there it is. And there's an orange, so we obviously need to put it there. The way to do that is to put it away from it, away. And then here, we turn it in. So it'll be like this, away, bottom layer, in, and then you pull this down, and then you put this, this, we put the middle layer to match it up, and then we pull it back up. And there it is, right in the place that we need it. And now we mess up white, so let's go ahead and put it back. So we pull it up, and this is there, we need to put it there. So you just put it away, in, 
and we just need to push this side and done. And now we have a blue and orange. Let's look for another one. There, we've got a red and green. So let's go ahead and mess it up with the red. And we do the same thing that we did for the other one. So we put it away, in, down, across, up. Now we've got it where we need it. But we messed up the white, so just go ahead and solve it. Put it that way. Now let's look for another one. There we have a green and orange. So we do the exact same thing that we did with the other one. So we go out, in, down, across, and up. And now we just have to continue and solve the white again. Done, just like that. And there isn't another one. Oh, but it's in the wrong place. It's switched. So we just have to replace it and then put it back where it is. So let's, let's replace with this. Out. In. Down. Across. And then up. And let's go ahead and fix up the white. And now let's look for it. There. The red, let's match it up, and blue. So that's where we put the other. Now we have to put it back where it is. So away, in, down, across, and up. And then let's go ahead and fix the white. If we put it up to match up with the white. And then this has to go here. So we take, put it away so we don't interfere and then put it to the bottom. So we take it away and then put the bottom down and then it's here. So we just turn it to make a line and then pull it up. And now we have solved the bot the second layer. So this time we need for set two, we need to do the flower, which it looks like this. So we just have this yellow dot and around the edges is white. And I'll be teaching you how to do that. So as we see, it already has one done, that just makes it easier. So you just find one, and then you put it, and then you put it up. You just do that. And then we found two here, so let's just start with one. So let's look for, the, we found this, and let's put it up here. Pull it up, and now we've got this one here. So if it's like this, and you want to flip it, you can't do that, you can't just flip it like that. So you turn it in it's right there and now you put it there just like that and then you put it up there and second step is to do the white cross but we already have this on the bottom here not up here but we have to match it up first so let's go this we done the two blue and the white so we just turn it so it can match with the white Let's go back to the yellow. Do the same thing with the orange. Just like that, orange. Turn it down. Now it's matched up. And now the red. Let's match it up. And then let's turn it to the white cross. And we just have one more. Not so much. Right there. And the last one is green. So let's match it up with the green. And now let's turn it to the white cross, just like that. And now you have to fill in the corners, you have to fill in the corners with white. And it has to be correct because we can't just put the red and green in the blue and red. You can't do that because it won't match up. Because there's red there, but there's blue, but we need to we need it to be green. So there's blue and red. So if it's right down here and it has to get up here somewhere. So let's go ahead and match it up with the blue. So there it is matched up. There's white here and red. 
So now note it has to go up here in this corner. So now it's like that. Let's turn this like that and it's there. And now we've got it lined up and put it back up. And now we've got the red and blue. And let's do the same thing with the orange and blue. So let's go ahead and match it up with the orange. And we now need to know that it has to go up here. So you do the same thing as we did for the other one. You turn it like that, match it up, put it up, just like that. And let's do the same thing with the green and orange. Match it up with the green. It's an orange is right there. We just need to put it up here. So you turn it, put it in, match it up, put it up. And now it's matched up. Now we only have one more corner to solve. So there it is, right there. So it's already in its place. So we just have to go like that, turn it, put it in, lined up push it back and now you have so solve the top layer and now you have to solve the second layer which is the middle so this is how you solve it so now in the third step for the middle layer you have to solve this so we need to find the red and blue red and blue let's go in here so just go ahead and find a red and blue, red and blue right here, red and blue. So let's match it up with the blue as it already is, blue matched up. And now we have to get it here because that's where the red and blue is. So the way to do that, you put it away, away, and then from, the, from here, you put it in from where it wants to go. And then you put this down. And it's right there, so we just turn it across, already lined up, and we pull it up. Now it's done with that. But we messed up the white. So let's go ahead and solve it. Up, and there's one more, it just needs to go up there. So you can't just take it out and put it there. So we put it away, and then we put this down, and then we pull it across to make the line, and then up. And now it's solved. And the red and blue is now there. Now let's find another one. Green and orange. So with the green, you match it up with the green. And as you see, the two are solved. So we just have to check. Oh, there. There's has to go here. But there's already green here, but yellow it doesn't match up. So let's go ahead and match. put this up there. So we go away, in, and then down cross up and then just go ahead and match the white up across down and then put the white back where it needs to go and then push it up and now oh you know we've solved the whole thing except the blue and orange but it's already in its place but it just switched so you can't just switch it around so I have to replace the replace it and then put it where it's supposed to be so we go away in down across and then up just go ahead and solve the white again up and then away down across let's put it up there and now we need to put this back where it needs to go so let's go ahead and do that put the orange matched up and then you take it away from where it needs to go away and then in from the bottom and then pull that down put it across push it up and now we have this hole for the white so you push it up this has to go across this goes down and then we put it across and then we solve the second layer now let's solve for the third layer. Now we've if you this there are heaps of ways that it can be. It could have just the white, the yellow dot, or it could have the L like I do, or it could have the line straight across. Now we have to solve the yellow cross. So this is the algorithm that you have to do. 
So if you have the L like me, you just put put it in the top left corner and then you follow these moves. So you go face and then up and then U, which is up. And now we've got the cross, the like the straight up line. Let's do the same thing as we did with the other move. So now we've solved the top Y and the middle layer. Now we have to do the yellow cross. Now we we have to for like you might when you finished you might have just like me the line you might have the L shape or you might have the dot. The L it has to be in the left hand corner and if you have the line it has to be horizontal and if it, you just have the dot like anyway you turn it, it's gonna be a dot. So for like you finish you you do F and then you go up and then across down across and and if you don't have the yellow cross you do it like you do the move again and again and now we we've, we've got the yellow cross and now we need the fish so it's this is called the spin move so if you if you're doing the right spin move this would stay this would go up this would go up and this would go up but we only want one to go up so let's do the other way this will say this will go up this will go up and this will go up that's no good now let's turn it and see this will stay this will go up this will go up and this will go up that's no good too if we do it the other way this would stay this would go up this would go up this would go up that means all of them would go up so let's turn and do it again and let's check so this would stay this would go up this would go up and this would go up so none would go up so that's not good let's try the other way this would say this would go up this would go up this would go up let's try the other side this would say this would go up this would go up this would go up that's not good this would say this would go up this would go up this would go up so they're all going to go up so we have just have to do the move again and again so this is the right spin move so you go up and then across and then down and then across and then up and then across twice and then down we've got the same thing now we have to do we have to check again this would say this would go up this would go up this would go up that's not good we would say this would go up this would go up and this would go up that's good so we do the left spin move, which is the same thing but the other way. So you go up, across, down, across, up, and then twice across, down. And now we've got the fish, or it looks like a fish. So now to sort, we have to we want like this yellow, this yellow, and this yellow. It doesn't matter if it's not in the right way. We just want to want it to go up. So now you put it across. Now let's do the same thing. So this would stay. This would go up. This would go up, and this would go. Up. That's not good. This would stay. This would go up. This would go up, and this would go up. Okay, so we can only do this move again. So let's go up, across, down, across, up, twice across, and down. We've got one more to do. So let's do the move again, twice. So this would stay, this would go up, this would go up, and this would go up. So let's do that. Let's do up, across, down, across, up, across, twice. Down. We've got the fish straight and see if it works this time. This would stay, this would go up, this would go up, and this would go up. So we'd only have one one that two would that would go up. So we can't do that one. Let's try the other one. This would stay, this would go up, this would go up, and this would go up. So let's just do the other one. And now we have to put the, we have to do a spin move. So this is how it works. One would stay, now this would go up, this would go up, and this would go up, which is good. You just need the yellows to go up, but it doesn't have to be in the correct place. So let's do it up, 
across, down, across, up, across, twice, and then down. Now we've got the full yellow. And now let's just match up corners. And if you have like this, like I do, which is good, but if you don't, and the corners aren't matched up like mine, just do this move. So you go down, across, down, across, up, across, up. And now let's solve this. So this would say this would go up, this would go up, and this would go up. So let's do this move. Up, across, down, across, up, across, across, down. Now we've got the, the yellow. Let's match it up. If you still don't have the, like, just the centers that aren't matched up, do the move again, which is what I have to do. So you go down, across, down, down, across, up, up, across, up. Let's do the move again. Yep. Up, across, up, across, up, twice across, and down. And now we've got one side fixed, but this side isn't. And we've got only one move to do. So this, we only have one center, three centers that we have to do. So for this one, you have to go, this has to go here, and this has to go here to make it all full that. So the move for that, you do the right spin move followed by a left spin move. So let's do the right spin move followed by the left spin move. So let's just put that there. That'll go up, that'll go up, and that'll go up. Let's do the left spin move. Done. And now you'd have the corners Blue, match it up, and we've got it. Now we have to do it one more time. Up, across, down, across, up, across, across, down. Let's put it here. Now let's do the other spin move. And now you just have to match it up. And that is a video on how to solve. Please subscribe and put a thumbs up. And that's how to solve the... Rubik's Cube. Thank you.